this video is sponsored in part by Play Studios. Hmm, looks like the Nile isn't just a river in Egypt anymore. Is the Ace of Vegas, the Ace of Vegas. Hey, my spinners and sharks, Ace of Vegas here, and I hope you're doing well. Now, for today's video, what we wanted to go ahead and do is wanted to try out the new powers in the Nile game. Mad shout out to my friends at Play Studios, they got me a copy of the regular version before they were able to drop it on everyone else's, although I recorded this video a little late, so by the time this pops up, it's probably going to be released on everybody else's game. That said though, let's go ahead and crack into this thing and see how we do. This is Powers of the Nile. Okay, Spinners and Sharks, so it looks like we're sitting at, uh, oh, we can get the Ultra Jackpot pretty easily here at five and a half. Um, why don't we go ahead and do that then? So let's go ahead and uh, pick up our chips here. Looks like we're going to be starting at 375,287,474 chips, and we're going to be betting uh, five and a half million per spin. So, that means we're going to be putting a sum total of half a billion chips through the machine to go ahead and see how good this game is, and I think we're going to have a blast. So, let's go ahead and put 100 spins on the clock on the spin and one meter over here. On your mark, get set, ready, and go! Alright guys, so we are going straight into this over here, and it looks like... Uh, yeah, so it looks like it's going to be a pretty clean themed uh, Egyptian pyramid sort of game over there. So kind of like the Luxor, but unlike Luxor, I think this is going to have a different set of bonuses. And oh, it looks like we got a double wild already. And let's see what Anubis is going to do over here. Oh, we got a rare jackpot. What? Oh, it it's a literal jackpot. Okay, I get it now. <laughs> that is actually pretty funny. I'm not going to lie. Alright guys, we are still in uh, quarantine over here, so Vegas still hasn't opened up yet. Um, it's looking like the governor might consider letting casinos open back up sometime in June here. Oh, and we got another jackpot that gave us some wilds. And that's a common jackpot. I wonder how many of each of these jackpots you need, you need to get something. I wonder if you have to match them all, and that's what the, uh, that's what the benefit is up here. You gotta get five of something. But they're literal jackpots, and I think that's amazing. Oh, let's see. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We're only about 15 spins in right now, so we're still doing pretty... Oh, there's another common jackpot. Times two, though. Oh, okay, I think I get it. That's. Oh, wait, no, that's a rare jackpot, too. Oh, because it has two gems on it. Okay, I think I get it. Oh, all right, that was a big 99 million chip win right there that's what's up that's what's up oh I love that there's a counter up here I, I really feel like there should they should bring back spin counters I really kinda miss that but mainly for the purposes of my own videos so I don't have to keep track manually alright but yeah it looks like uh, they're trying to get to the point all the casinos on the strip are trying to get to the point where they can uh, reopen and they're really excited about doing that oh it looks like we got another common jackpot over here another literal common jackpot and I'm not sure about you guys I'm, I'm a little excited about going back to Vegas but at this point uh, I'm also feeling really patient about going back to Vegas just because it doesn't sound like there's gonna be much to do there aren't gonna be any nightclubs and there aren't going to be any pool parties, and there probably aren't going to be any lounges, aren't going to be any, like, ultra lounges, or even just regular chill lounges that, you know, I just love to sit, I just love to sit in a lounge, it's just a lot more comfortable for me. Okay, there we go, that was four literal jackpots. Now I wonder if I have to fill them all up, and that's how the bonus goes off, or what happens there. I guess we'll find out. Oh, there is another literal jackpot with all the and all the Egyptian gods are just kind of coming through for us right there, except for Lady Gaga. She is not coming through as an Egyptian god right now. Um, I don't know. Oh, all right, so we filled up all of them. Oh, so we unleashed the powers of the Nile. We filled up all of them, and now we're gonna go ahead and see what happens now that we filled them all up. Let's go. Let's go. So we get free spins now. So anytime you fill up the whole thing, get free spins, and now uh, we get wilds over here. 
And we got our boy Anubis coming through. What's up? What's up with those wilds? Boom, baby. Okay, rare Anubis wilds. That was dope. And now, let's see what we get here. Alright, and that was the camel, so I think that's Hathor. Oh, it actually tells you the god's name up top over here. That's pretty dope. Alright, see if we can get that respin, though. So it was double respin, because it was a rare one. Okay. Cool, cool. Spin till win. Oh, there's another Hathor spin till you win over here. Let's get some more of those wilds, though. No, we gotta get that spin till we win. And that's a double. That's a double in the center. Gotta get that spin till we win. Oh, that's 11 million. Not bad, not bad. Okay. And then let's see how we do with this one over here. So that's Sobek. I was hoping Set was gonna show up over here, but we got Sobek, so it's cool. Oh, Sobek gets us a guaranteed win across it's Link symbols. Okay. That was kinda cool. And I think that's uh, back to Hathor again. So, Hathor is the spin until you win. Nope, didn't win that one, so we get a double. Oh, hopefully we lose this next one, too, so we can get a triple. Do we get a triple? Oh, we do get a triple if we miss it. Let's go. Let's go, guys. Oh, is that going to be a quad? What? Do, oh, this is going to be a big one. That's a five times? Yeah, it's just going to keep jacking it up until we win something. Oh, there it is, there it is, that's a three of a cut, huge 110 million, that's what's up, that's what's up. Now we got the winged dragon of Raw. <laughs> Let's go Raw. That's that win streak right there. Okay, oh, did we get a streak going? We got a streak going? Let's get that big streak. Oh, hold up. He's holding on to those for some reason. What's good, Raw? Oh, we get the cats. So the cats and the queens are good. And then we either need a king or another cat. Oh, there's that king that we need. Oh, huge win. 116 million. Look at that win. Man, look at that. Too strong. Too strong. Major jackpot right there. Serious jackpot. 275 million. That is insane. That's that, uh... Ooh, that was that rare jackpot. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. All right, let's go ahead and keep going now. And I guess if we get some more of these over here, then we also win a jackpot too. So we get, so if we fill these up, we get free spins, and then we also get a jackpot. That's actually kind of dope. This is actually a really good game here. I think. I think there's a really great opportunity to get free chips and some good wins here by the looks of things. Getting that ultra jackpot. Okay, there we go, 53 million, let's go, let's go, and we're only like 37 spins into this, so we're gonna be it. We're actually not doing too bad. I'm actually really impressed. Oh, and there's another rare jackpot, so that's gonna go ahead and link up too. Man, this, this is gonna be a really good game. Actually, I think we're gonna get a lot of loyalty points off this, and we're gonna have a really good time back in Vegas. Hopefully when the buffets show back up, and hopefully when the, uh, you know, when we can get our comp rooms back and all that. Uh, now as far as, and everyone's been asking me, when's the first time that we're going to be able to get back to Vegas? And you know, frankly, I don't know. Uh, that's up to the governor. I'm not the governor, nor should I be the governor. If before anyone says ace for governor in the comment section, absolutely not. I should not be the governor. I have no political experience, and you, I, I believe you should have some political experience or some good leadership experience before you do any of that, and that's not my style, and I'm totally cool with that. Uh, I'd much rather be Sensei than uh, <laughs> than the Governor or Taicho or anything like that. You know what I mean? For those of you guys that speak Japanese, you know what I'm talking about. All right, cool, cool. Um, but also, it, now is a great time to start playing your My Vegas. And if you want to, it might not be a bad idea to invest a couple bucks into it. Um, just on the merit that you do get some two uh, two night stays there, you can get them at Bellagio and New York, New York. In fact, I actually have a video on what happens when you spend, uh, spend money in my Vegas slots, and I'll leave that in a link to the description box. Yeah, I'll link it in the description box below, or I might just go ahead and link it in a corner card or something like that. So that's if you want to. If you don't want to, hey, don't do it. No worries. There's lots of great rewards, too. And there are a couple, uh, 
multi-night ones too, but I was just thinking because Bellagio is allegedly, according to Bill Hornbuckle, the, uh, C the current CEO of MGM Resorts, he's trying to open up New York, New York first and Bellagio. So those are two pretty good places to get uh, two free nights. If you're looking for the free nights, I'd probably recommend those places there, just on the merit that, I mean, Bellagio, it's the premier five-star hotel there. That's It's been like that for a while. It's a win classic. You got to do that. But if you're looking for a budget hotel, then I'd probably say New York, New York's really good. It's highly underrated, in my opinion. Oh, there is another common jackpot right there. We got space for three more jackpots. Let's see. What else do we get? What else do we get? I don't think we got our... I don't think that counted the common. Alright, we gotta get some more literal jackpots. <laughs> I just love how it's actually got literal pots over here for the jackpot. That's amazing. This is probably my favorite newest game ever. This actually might be one of the best uh, games in my Vegas slots ever, just on the merit that we got over... I think we might have actually gotten over 100% payback on a really high bet. Uh, no, we've still got like 21 spins to go. We could very well go higher than that, and those were really great bonuses. The bonuses on this are amazing, and they're, they seem to be pretty much guaranteed here. So once you hit a bonus, you're definitely doing some damage to your uh, to the casino's bankroll there, and you're uh, definitely taking a lot of your bankroll back, and I like that. Really like that in the game. So this looks like it has a pretty consistent payback percentage as long as you hit those actual jackpots. And it looks like the optimal spin on this one might actually be five and a half million. Or maybe I'm just lucky, I don't know. I don't know, it's a promotional game. Promotional games seem to be a bit looser when you first start, and then as you go forward, then it seems to be a little different. But this also seems to be my Vegas original game, like an original Play Studios game, versus a licensed one, and those usually we do better on anyway. All right, guys, last 10 spins over here. We're making a profit regardless. Uh, we are the Egyptian prophets making profits. <laughs> That was a bad joke, and I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I don't know why I made that, but it was a bad joke, and I apologize. But I don't. It's cool. All right, let's see if we can get back up there. Eight, eight and a half million. Not bad. We got four more spins to go. I'm really excited about this. Man, look at all these loyalty points too. We're just racking up the loyalty points. No questions asked. Here we go. There's number 99. I don't think we're going to get another uh, bonus here, but I'm glad that we got to see the official bonus there. All right, cool, cool. All right, so that was our 100 spins. They're really 101 spins, but whatever. Who's counting? Actually, I'm counting, so <laughs> that does matter. All right, folks. Well, it looks like we ended up with 449,867,474 chips here. And I think we racked up something like uh, four or 5,000 loyalty points just in the last 10 or 15 minutes since we've been playing. So I'll tell you what we're going to go ahead and do. Per usual, I'm going to go ahead and take a quick break. We're going to do some math, and we'll uh, count up the booty. All right, Spinners and Sharks. So that was actually a really good game over here, Powers of the Nile. It fits everything that we need. Relatively new game has these stacking jackpots here, and it's got a guaranteed metric that you have to hit before it gives you free spins and before it gives you a bonus session. And we were able to get all those, and we got a lot, great payback percentage on it. Our exact payback percentage was 113.56%. So, based on that alone, that definitely makes it one of the best games in my biggest slots and earns the heart over here. So if you're looking for a good game that's going to go ahead and keep you rolling for a while, as well as replenish your chip count, I think Powers of the Nile is the best bang for your buck for your bankroll as of right now. Definitely has beaten the tar out of a couple other ones, because we didn't do so good on My Vegas Diamonds, comparatively speaking, and on Santa's Wild Workshop, whereas other promotional games like Disco Dracula and most recently uh, Kong, Eighth Wonder of the World, we actually did really, really great at. So that's a great reason to try out Powers of the Nile if you haven't already. And that should be out. I'm hoping by the time that this video is out, uh, this will be out for the rest of you guys to go ahead and play. Uh, once again, mad shoutouts to uh, Yo-Yo and Cat over at Play Studios for hooking me up with the chips and her hooking me up with a little bit of early access to this game so I could try it out for you guys. And that just about wraps it up for today's video. 
If you enjoyed today's content and found it informative, I'd appreciate a like, and feel free to subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, next time, what we're going to go ahead and do is we're going to go ahead and use some of our MyVegas rewards in a large capacity, but we're going to be a little limited by certain situations, so we're going to go ahead and see how that works out. Until next time, though, this is Ace of Vegas signing out, wishing you all strong hands, and of course, happy spinning, you guys. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva Ace of Vegas. Viva Ace of Vegas.